All times. It's all about the competitive nature. You, you want to have yourself, give yourself the most advantage possible. And what's going to give yourself the most advantage? Have playing a character that you know that you're going to do super, super well with versus another one. Yep. But yeah, right now he's down one round and he's getting oppressed pretty hard by the ice. Well, you know, it is going to happen. You know, when you're playing against Colleen, you got to expect to get to get counters. To yeah, you got to expect to get parried. You know, you can't really let that fool yeah. you. He's definitely countering a lot. Like, he's fishing for it a lot after certain setups. He, and just, he just knows the. Yeah. He just knows when people want to press buttons. They have to adapt to that and, like, just walk up throw or walk up do delayed button. Exactly. A lot of times they're giving it, like, they're plus two, and he's just, like, mashing light. So he's going to counter. A good thing just to do for you is just to maybe just go for the throw attempt after the ice. You know, because yeah. you, you really can't check him after that with three from. But what, what is this? Did, did, was that already? Yeah, he already game lost one? game one. Yeah, let's was Game one. They are my goodness. <laughs> Boogie Lopez in losers scores the game one point over Cobra Tango, who is actually in there. You go. See, see, he did a late normal there and he got a counter hit. Yeah. I'm not sure if he went for the counter and it was just hit the startup or he hit a button, but it's, he needs to do a lot more of that. He's definitely going to have to have some kind good of answer. With it. Corner push. Oh, that almost caught. I thought that was going to get it. He definitely got the bait, but he did it too late, I believe. So he didn't get the combo. Oh, oh he this, went for the throw. This, this is the throw. He was crouching. Counter hit, crouching, beating kick. Pops him into B trigger. He needs to go for the throw. Out of here. I think he went for the throw there. Oh it's my like, goodness, look at the oh, reach. They're, they're just fishing for counter. Dude. Who's going to get crushed? on that stuff. Dude, V-Trigger 2 is actually crazy. It's, an, it's immense. She like turns into like a little baby dolls him. It's ridiculous. Ability, the, the ability to get through fire. Oh, oh, is he dead? There's no way he's dead. Yeah, I was like, that's way too much life. That's basically what happened with Jewel Man earlier. He miscalculated really hard on the super, and it yeah. definitely cost him. And this yeah. might cost him the round. Yeah, yup, well, there it is. Nice. Oh, nice. Good job, Richard. Corbett Tango showing that he will not be dissuaded into playing his game. Yeah, that, that's one of the things that's really important in fighting games is you never want to, like, let your opponent condition you. I mean, there's certain things you have to respect, but you don't always want to, like, oh, well, he baited this twice. I can't never have it in an option. You that's always right. have to, like, represent certain options. That's right. Just to make the opponent scared of hitting buttons or scared of doing whatever they're yeah, doing. The last thing you want to do is just uh, bottleneck yourself into one style of gameplay. Mm -hmm. then, it gets, then you get a little bit too, uh, you know, you're able to get red too easily. Yeah, so a common, like thing, a common thing in Street Fighter V is where people will just not throw tech. Stunt? Let's see. Uh, Oh, so close. Damn, He's defense. still not over. He's still not out of this. Uh-oh. Oh. This is big boy damage. That's right. He's coming in. What's going to happen? Oh. oh, nice. Now he might get stunned after this combo. If he gets hit one more time, he might lose the round. He might lose the round. I think it. he's dead. He might be dead. The super. He's dead. Look at that. Look he's at dead. That. No scale. Ooh. He's dead. God. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Street Fighter V in a nutshell. And you know what that took? <laughs> A V trigger, act a good V trigger activation into combo. That took a good character with a good V trigger mm -hmm. and a, a pretty good player. Yeah, you know? that's that's just, just what happens sometimes. He's just, just crouching his ground. He's just wondering how he lost that. I'm wondering how he lost that too. He's like, man, I played so well for for a good 60 <laughs> seconds. You know, just, uh, sometimes you just got to block. And then you play bad for 10 seconds and, and you lost. And you lost, and then it's just like, wow. You know, <laughs> hello, Street Fighter Five. Yeah. <laughs> that's the most fighting games now, but that's why we that's happens. why we that's why we love this game. Yeah, like I was saying, a lot of pitfall that a lot of Street Fighter Five players fall into is the tech, the take the throw thing. Oh like, yeah, the you can't take skill. six or seven in a row. It just you have to eventually tech. So that's one thing that a lot of people just. It's a very popular misconception. You're right. Yeah. Because yeah. it's one thing to take two or three throws and not get crushed countered like he did for 60, 70 percent. But if you take five or six throws, it adds up, and then you force them to start taking. And here we go, right back into the same thing. You know, Kuma was getting oppressed very heavily. Pops V trigger. Now it's a different story. Yeah, if he gets hit, he's dead. Oh, he's, he's dead. Not. He's gonna get supered and he's dead. No way. Say I think it he's dead. So. I think Not he's like dead. This. Oh, Ooh. no, never mind. He's really close. Oh, oh. Okay, good, good, good. I was like, Ooh. that's the worst feeling when you bait something yeah. and don't punish it and then lose the round. It's the worst feeling. Oh, my goodness. It's, it's the just worst like, feeling. You had it. Yeah. It's like you, you second guess yourself a little bit. You're like, okay, he's going to throw here. Let me walk back. And then you see the throw. You're like, wait, why didn't I hit a button? <laughs> too crazy. Too clean. Too fresh. Too nuts. Wow. Oh, With man. Full, full jump in. Doesn't finish the combo. I guess he didn't really think he was going to hit, but if he got the throw. Looks like he's got Stops. the read on Boogie's defense, to be honest. Every time he's getting in, he's definitely mauling him. Especially when he has V-Trigger. <laughs> it just looks like when uh, he has V-Trigger, Boogie Lopez just shuts down. and just gets hit with fireballs and dies. That, he's oh, throw teching okay. like That's crazy. He's, yeah, he definitely has a read on that. Yeah, like he's reading his. Every time he's gone for the forward heavy, it's pretty much hit. Mm -hmm. it's I think he maybe missed that one that he mistimed, but it's otherwise, a very high success rate, crazy. Sure. Jeez. Corbo Tango, very taking very convincing round two of. Uh, and yeah, he's definitely going right in. There. Yeah, like that's what I'm noticing is that Colin is controlling the neutral free, but like that one hit or that one knockdown, his defense is just crumbling. Yeah. Like as soon as he gets touched. Yeah. Absolutely. So he definitely needs to clean up his defense and not be so predictable, so especially against a character with such big damage. And this is this is where he really has to make an adjustment because this is. Yeah, he could lose the tournament if he loses this, this is, game. This is it. This is it's two one. Kobe Tango's in winners. See, he's playing nice, clean, neutral. He's getting nice buttons. He's not getting hit by anything. 
But he oh. Just, oh, good good retreat. Good nice parry. Get out of here. Kick, kick, him, kick him in the chest. Dude, he's winning the neutral, and it's like, oh, he, I think he might be dead. Or really close. Very stunned. Oh, no. He's dead. Follow up. It doesn't matter yeah. the follow up. Perfect. Yeah, perfect. Nice. Ends it with a perfect. Boogie Lopez. He's recovering nicely. He will not be pressured. He will not be bullied by this top tier character because I am myself top tier. <laughs> They're definitely both top five characters, in my opinion. Not, not so many people play Colleen for some reason, but I think she's definitely top tier. She's very, she's a very impressive character. Very scary to play against for sure. Especially with V Trigger two. Mm -hmm. V Trigger one was good, but V Trigger two like pushed her over the edge into being like crazy good. Ooh, good block on the chop. Does get the counter hit. It seems like he is adapting his defense because that's the first time that forward heavy didn't hit him. Yeah. So he's definitely learning. We got jab there. It works out in Buki Lopez's favor. Cobra Tango trying to fish with that fierce. Oh. Wow. Um. All right, you know what? I guess he'll be able to build meter. You know, that's fine. That's an okay thing. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but I mean, uh, that's what he did, so. Uh, you know, the health advantage, blah, 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 you know, I don't know. Oh, this good teleport. Perfect. He hasn't done that, like, the whole set, so that Colleen just wasn't ready. I don't know if he's done that whole tournament. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, so V Trigger activated for both oh, characters. And, and uh, that's where the match starts and ends. Got blasted <laughs> with the fireballs. What can you say? The rest is history, right? Yeah. Boom, boom. See, like, he's winning neutral pretty hard, I think, the Colleen. Yeah. It's just he's not getting the damage that Akuma gets. Yeah, it's just the... And I think Colleen's pressure on Akuma isn't as working as well, because he's definitely not landing hits once he does knock him down. Like, look, we'll see what he goes for here. It's a clear air superiority from Akuma as well. See, again, he just lets him out. Well, I mean, in that situation, you know, it's kind of... Sometimes Akuma's just going to get going. Uh-oh, he's almost at V trigger. Oh, but it's on them hands. He's about to get stunned, too. Oh, he interrupted the overhead that would have stunned. That's yeah, that really, really good. Yeah, that really was a scary situation for Cobra. Yeah, Tech. he definitely would have really lost. worked out in his favor. See, but look, uh-oh. Now he has V-Trigger. He's uh, about to get super. Oh, my, this is going to hurt. He might be stunned. Did he choose his option with the EXDP in that situation? He did. Host order, but doesn't get oh, overhead. It, always. That's over. V-Trigger cancel. Cool. Oh, that's he didn't right. even hit G's. And Cobra Tango takes it. GG's, everybody. Give it up. Boogie Lopez Colleen making it this far here in San Japan Street Fighter V. But Cobra Tango ultimately taking it. Our Street Fighter V San Japan winner. <laughs> And in the infamous words of Sanford Kelly, pick a top two.